Hello YouTube, today we will hear Classics Cliff Jump with the Devil Horns add-on kit. I got Cliff Jump a couple of weeks ago from Amazon and the Devil Horns custom kit I got yesterday from Kapow Toys. First we'll look at Cliff Jumper and then we'll take a look at the add-on kit. And finally, Cliff Jumper will have a G1 accurate head and really awesome looking weapons. Here we have Cliff Jumper in robot mode and compared with Bumblebee. There's not much difference between these two. They both look exactly like each other, except this one's yellow, that one's red, that one's got more silver, and that one's got more black. But luckily, we do have a custom kit. Well, actually, we have two customs kit. We have this customs kit, and we have the fans project kit. And I didn't get the fans project one, just because I didn't know it was out there, and I didn't have this guy at that time, so... I didn't get it, but inside we get a black tray with the two guns and the head. Now that head is extremely G1 accurate. I mean, I've seen the Fanch Project one, and compared to this, this one is better. This one is way better than the Fanch Project one. Now, I do have to agree, the Fans Project 1, for how much it cost, to how much you got with it, was a little bit better than this kit. And some people have been saying, well, you get grey guns, you get black guns for the Fans Project 1. Right, the Fans Project Black Cannon was not G1 accurate. In the cartoon, his cannon was silver. This one's grey. Grey is a lot closer to the silver than black is the silver, so this one is far more G1 accurate. And you get the laser pistol, which, to be honest, I'm just going to give to Bumblebee, because this gun is just so awesome with Cliff Jumper. Now, let's move things to the side. How do you get his head off? Basically, you put your thumb on this plate here, tilt his head back, tilt his head back, keep tilting, keep tilting, got to keep tilting it back until it pops off. Now getting it off, the head off, is easy. Getting this head on is probably going to be a lot more harder because it's smaller. And I was warned that these two little pieces here are very easy to bend. So, let's just see if I can get this on without breaking it. Here is Cliff Jumper with the add-on kit. The head is a little bit tricky to get on. The socket joint is a little bit smaller than it is on the actual head. But it fits on there nice and tightly. You get the two guns, which are very very cool the cannon is awesome i mean look at that cannon i mean this is cliff jumper now he is no longer bumblebee i mean the differences i mean this kit is well worth it if you want to make your classics cliff jumper look like cliff jumper and no longer like a red repaint of bumblebee if you have the fans project add-on kit no, this is not worth it. If you don't have the fans project kit, is this worth getting for your cliff jumper? Hell yeah. This is one of the best add-on kits I've gotten in a while. These guys. These guys. I hope to see more of your stuff coming out really soon because this is just this is cliff jumper now this is cliff jumper and as i said before if you don't have the fans product kit and you have this cliff jumper get him this has been nemesis prime uk2 and i'll see you the next time i feel like doing a review